Hey everyone, my name's Elliot and I'm a small animal veterinarian over in England. So I wanted to talk to you about how to calculate a metoclopramide CRI. You can either run metoclopramide in a syringe driver or add it into a, a patient's sort of maintenance fluids. Uh, for this example, we will pick the, the fluid bag rather than the syringe driver just to switch things up a bit. So for our example today, our patient weighs 10 kilos. The dose we're going to be giving is 1.5 mg per kg per day. The, the dose range is 1 to 2 mg per kg, so we're not going to commit. We're going to go right in the middle. Um, so our 10 kilogram patient needs 1.5 milligrams per kilogram per day. When we do this, our kilograms will cancel out, leaving us with 15 milligrams per day. Not overly helpful, so we need to convert this to milligrams per hour. And we know that there in one day there are 24 hours. So our day is going to cross out and that's going to leave us with approximately 0 0.63 milligrams per hour. So our little friend here is going to need 0 0.63 milligrams per hour of metoclopramide. There's a couple of different ways you can go here. Um, I think what we'll do is we'll now figure out how many mils per hour our patient needs. So the concentration that generally is on the shelf is five mix per mil, but always double check before you do this. Um, so to get our mils, we're gonna divide by concentration of five milligrams per mil. And that's gonna leave us with 0 0.13 mils per hour of metoclopramide. So we're gonna step away from the metoclopramide for a moment and we're gonna look at our fluid rate. So our patient weighs 10 kilos and we're giving fluids at three mils per kilo per hour. Which, as you all figured out, is equal to 30 mils per hour. If we've got a 500 mil bag, and we're running at 30 mils per hour, mils are gonna cancel out, and that's gonna leave us with about 16.7 hours worth of fluid. So, if we know that we're giving 0 0.13 mils per hour of metoclopramide, and we know that this bag lasts for 16.7 hours, we need to give 16.7 hours worth of metoclopramide. So if we do 16.7 times 0 0.13, that's going to give us 2.1 mils of metoclopramide. I have taken some liberties with rounding, so I think it comes out to 2.17 if you round up at the 0.13. Either way, around 2.1 mils. Um, and you're just going to add that to your bag and make sure you, you mix it up thoroughly um, and then start running. If you want to titrate the dose in this situation, then what you need to do is take your desired dose. So let's say you want to go up to 2 milligrams per kilogram per day, divide it by the current dose of 1.5 milligrams per kilogram per day, and then multiply that by your current rate, which is 30, which gives us 40 mils per hour. Um, if you want to go the other way, you just do the same thing, your, your desired dose, maybe you want to go down to 1, so you do 1 divided by 1.5 times 30, um, and that will give you 20. So it's, it's fairly straightforward to titrate up or down. I uh, hope that was helpful.